I worked all my life. I worked all my life when I was a kid, shining shoes, then in the military, and working in a bomb factory, working in an auto factory, and boxing. I was on the search department for 23 years. I worked all my life. And it would work now if I could if I could afford it without this oxygen. I just hate sitting at home. But I love to see people that's going to school. And then when I get these letters with people thanking me for the little donation I get, that makes me feel real good. That I finally done something for New Mexico. I love New Mexico. Bob Costa, a hard hitter who has defeated heavyweights as well as light heavyweights and has racked up 10 knockouts and 14 wins. Foster is hungry for the acclaim and money that comes with being a contender. When I fought Dick Tiger, he was champion. He's from Nigeria, you know, tough little dude. Bob Foster has a tremendous reach and is using it to good advantage with those long jabs against the five foot seven inch champion. And I said, Tiger, why don't you just take the money? It cost me $100,000 to get a shot at it. I'm the only guy that had to pay to get a shot at the title. I said, why don't you just take the money and give me the title? Because there's no way in God creation you're going to beat me. Well, he didn't speak English that good, but he said, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I beat you. I said, well, okay. Man, I was the happiest man in the world. Light heavyweight champion of the world. Sometimes I say, oh, well, it just wasn't meant for me to go to college. Because it, it wasn't in me to go to school, you know. Uh, but George Maloup was athletic inclined. By him being sports, you know, he football, basketball, you know, for the university. I went about to see him one day, and he said, uh, Bob, what are you doing all that money you make? I said, I don't make that much money. He said, why don't you give a scholarship to the university? I said, I can do that. Foster has done it again. Prove once more that he is the undisputed world light heavyweight champion. Destined to go down in ring history, as one of the great light heavyweight champions of all time. You don't need to have education to be a cop. You don't have to have education to be a professional fighter, you know. But it's other things that you, you need education for. You know, just working, period. That I was glad that I was, was able to afford to, to give them this money to help them out. You know, uh, cause today you know you need education. I don't. I want to just give everybody who ever wants scholarships, just give them the money. So you give two scholarships a year. I said, well, heck, I'll be dead and gone by the time that scholarship is. <laughs> I still have money in there. For, you know, I said that's good. It really is. <laughs>